is my first day um, of me basically quitting my job. So I'm not working anymore. I'm pretty much just grinding, saved up some money. So I'm just gonna be grinding to make this shit happen. I wanna be able to, you know, do videos full time. Do, you know, just do my purpose full time. The fuck was that? Gonna be on this Kindle reading for the morning. All right, I just did my um my little studying for the day. I'm studying um Twitch. I'm about to hop on Twitch. Oh man, I fucking drained. I did a uh, did week three of this writing course that we're taking. Dave found it, and um you know because we're still into filmmaking, still making, gonna be making our movies and stuff like that. So we're studying film, studying coding as well, um, and doing TikToks and being on social media more often. Since I quit my job, I'm gonna try to go harder online. You guys are gonna see a lot more content on YouTube and stuff like that from Road to Hollywood TV and also Nate's Room and Nate's Room's podcast. I'm gonna be doing podcasts and stuff like that. I actually have to edit a couple podcasts, but right now I gotta go and do some grocery shopping. I ain't got no food. I gotta take this, this right here. I take this. Uh, this is my fight against the the Rona, and I think by now y'all know what the Rona is. But this is like my multivitamin, and I don't take the multivitamins in um, pill form. I take it in liquid because I think it. Well, actually, my girl told me it hits your your body quicker. Oh shit! Almost forgot. You gotta shake this motherfucker. Mm. So what I think I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go get some breakfast um, from the yard shop, get some some dumpling and banana and everything there. And then I'm gonna go grocery shopping because I need to be, I need to get some grocery f foods and stuff like that because um, I need to stop eating out so much. God damn it. Oh, I'm heading to the shop now. Um, about to give my girl a call. I'm in a long distance relationship, so we've been in this for a while. But let's see what she's up to. Let's get some AC in this bitch. Your call has been forwarded wow. to an automatic voice message. All right, so you claim you love me, but you don't really love me, man. You don't really love me, man. And that's real. I'm done. Yo, sometimes you gotta be gangster like that, man. You gotta, you gotta live your life. You know what I'm saying? So, pretty much, guys, this is the journey, dog. I quit my job last Friday. That was May 23rd, I believe. Today's the 25th, and it's a Monday. May 23rd, I quit my job. Right now, it's like straight grinding. Like, I want things to happen within two to three months. The ultimate goal is to have our own studios. That's the shit right there. We'll be making movies, be paying the actors and actresses, whatever, you know, whoever that's a part of our project and take care of them and make dope ass films for you guys. Dope ass films for our generation. You remember Adam Sandler and his and his clique and he keeps on rotating his friends and his films? Same shit we want to do, man. <clears throat> it's the same <clears throat> exact recipe how we want it man but we're just gonna do it in a different way you know it's gonna take time it's gonna take a lot of studying that's why we're taking this course shouts out to dave for putting us on this uh this course man this writing course has it's been dope and julius always puts us on some different stuff too so shout out to him too so i've been i've been writing and uh trying to get better and that and that's the whole thing man i've been i've been doing this podcast uh trying to get better trying to interview as much people who are on a higher scale than me so that I can learn as much as I can learn and so you guys can learn as much as you can learn and that's what it's about right now man it's just about it's about doing what you want to do do your purpose in life you know what's going to make you happy when you get home because remember when you choose something that you're going to do as a career or whatever that you're going to do in life that's what you're going to be doing for the rest of your life so just make sure you get into the right shit I know sometimes you don't got no choice and you got to do what you got to do then you got to do what you got to do and you got to figure out what is gonna be making you happy while you're doing that you know whether it's your love of your life or your baby your kid whatever it is or you doing a hobby 
Just make sure you're doing something that you love to do to supplement the fact that you have a shit career. I'm studying coding so that it's something um, a friend told me, Wilonia. Shout out to Wilonius. He says it helps you with your problem solving. Like even with different situations that you're in. Um, in, in difficult situations, it helps you with problem solving. And I've never been a, been a big uh, person on problem solving. I hated math. I hated all that shit. So I feel like coding is something that will help me um, problem solve better. And also, <clears throat> I'll have that as a skill under my belt. So whenever we're building an app for RTA Studios, I can help build that app and, and, or, and join with another developer and I can know the back end and front end of that app so I can build it as dope as possible and as user friendly as possible for you guys who are, you know, in the app. So yeah, man. So I, I just got a lot of goals right now. Um, I'm trying to, I'm trying to crush them day by day, do little stuff day by day. I wake up in the morning early. This morning I woke up late because I've been kind of thrown off because I drank on Saturday uh, for my my cousin's girl's birthday and yeah I was a little thrown off but now you know I'm, I'm getting back into my circadian rhythm and uh, you know I wake up try to wake up at 5 a.m. 5:30 a.m. this morning I woke up at like 6:40 which is really bad or 6:30 um, and I try to get a little meditation in. Um, I do journal entries and I, I just write down like five things that I'm most grateful for in the world uh, right now or whatever and I do this every day I practice this every day and I go over my finances every day and try to figure out you know how to you know maximize my finances how to cut back on certain things today I just bought a meditation app which kind of hurt my pockets but I felt like it's good for my mental health you know what I'm saying so I got this minute it's called uh, it's a Sam Harris um, wake, it's called Waking Up by Sam Harris And it's he, he walks you through a lot of shit And, and meditating and all that But yeah uh, So much shit guys Totally forgot what day it was today And today is uh, Memorial Day So um, Yeah They're closed Oh shit uh, You know what I was going to get a patty but I'm gonna head over to the grocery store. Somebody look at this. Damn, Florida's weather has been shit lately, not gonna lie. Just came back from grocery shopping. I kind of messed up, guys, because I didn't bring the camera. Um, I gotta get used to uh, to bringing this camera around, and uh, I'm not used to it right now, but I went to uh, Trader Joe's. I don't know why I still have this mask on. I I'm gonna make something to eat, make some breakfast. It's about like 11 a.m. Make some breakfast. Pretty much knocking off things off my list here. I'm tired of waiting in line for for, for like you know something like the grocery store. It's, it's too much, man. It's too much. Look at this shit. Look at this shit, man. Shit is crazy, yo. Can't be doing stuff like this. Fucking back, boy. About to pack away these groceries. I just ran into these fuck boys, man. I'm just saying, I'm on more, man. I'm on more. Oh, yeah. oh, that's what we doing now. Yo, we back. That's what we you back. Dumb dick. Alright. Alright. Yo, Greg. Greg, I see you fucking losing weight, man. You doing your thing, B. You know what I'm saying? I'm out here, man. Stop playing. Yo, yo, big yo. Cleanse your fucking body, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was gonna show y'all my um my food while I was cooking, but there was so much shit happening. But it's almost done. It was real good. These pancakes are actually dairy-free pancakes. I'm not. Yeah, so I've been um editing, posted up a skit, edit edited a podcast. Um, I did my grocery shopping. A lot of stuff on the computer, some researching, some stuff like that. I still haven't coded yet. I think I'm gonna get to that around maybe at like 5.30. Still working. Right now I'm taking a little break. Watching Wrong Missy. Just cooked some little food. Do you have any idea what time it is, boy? Nah, man, we're not waiting on Greg, or else we're not gonna get this thing started, man. 
You can't see it's a storm outside. You think Greg's gonna drive through this to get here? He's gonna pull over. He's gonna make sure he's safe. We gotta continue the meeting. Huh? Bro, we need to start, bro. We will fill Greg in, bro. So we about to get into this meeting real quick. Oh, uh, Joel looking ripped up. What's up? Oh, uh, Wink looking real, real uh snazzy. What are we talking about today, Jules? Oh, we're talking about new goals, uh, new responsibilities for all the team individuals. Um, what could we all do to bring value to the to the brand and to the group, and what could we do to get better? And yeah, <laughs> just trying to focus on like mini goals and just keep chipping away. Man. Yeah, that's about it. There you go. I want to hear Winkler's response. That was it. I got nothing else Wink. to say. Julius had his own response. I want to hear David Winkler's response. I mean. Let's see what happens in the meeting. Let's let's talk about what? it. What? That's it for the day. I'm tired of shit. Well, actually 10:13. You guys stay safe out there. I know the corona is going down. Um, stay healthy and peace out. <laughs>